Did you know the first American to reach the moon followed a path traced by a black woman who wasn't even allowed to use the same restroom? Her name was Katherine Johnson. In the 1960s America, she worked at NASA. Brilliant, precise, invisible. Every day she carried her papers half a mile across campus, past the sign that read, Colored Women's Restroom. While others drank coffee from white mugs marked for engineers only, she drank from a small thermos she brought from home. She never complained. She just kept solving the math that no one else could. Then came Apollo 11. Computers gave the numbers, but the astronauts hesitated. One voice said, get the girl to check the math. For two sleepless days, Catherine sat under the hum of fluorescent light, writing, erasing, praying her hands were steady. When her equations finally matched, she whispered, it will hold. And it did. When Neil Armstrong stepped onto the moon, he was following the coordinates she had written by hand. Catherine Johnson lived to 101. When she finally received the Presidential Medal of Freedom, she said softly, they asked for my confidence. I gave them accuracy. The world looked looked up at the stars, but she was the one who reached them first.